This video is battery replacement on an APC Smart UPS. After a while, on your UPS, you'll find that the battery will die. It's just inevitable. Once the battery dies on your UPS, there are several options. 1. Replace the UPS. 2. Replace the battery with the original battery from the manufacturer. The third is actually rebuilding the battery, which quite frankly takes just a few minutes and is a lot cheaper. The battery from the manufacturer costs about $80 and comes in a nice, neat little package. To rebuild the battery, it's going to cost you about $40, each battery costing you about $20 a piece. These batteries are relatively easy to obtain. So once you've determined that the batteries do need replacing, and the flashing battery light there is definitely that indication, this UPS has been plugged in for about four years. I did bench test the unit and it was doing just fine, other than needing new batteries. From the display we can tell that the charger isn't even charging the battery anymore. So the first thing that we do is we pull the cover off the battery. Next thing we're going to do is remove the battery. It's actually got these two little tabs that are easy to pull the battery out with. There's two plastic sheets on top of the battery. They're very easy to pull off. Then all we have to do is disconnect the batteries from the battery assembly. These are type F2 connectors, so they're going to pull off a little bit hard. Once the battery is removed from the assembly, then it's just a matter of putting things back together again. This is a pretty basic little assembly. You just got to make sure the polarity is correct. Then it's just a matter of reinstalling the labels. The labels kind of hold everything together. Then it's just a matter of sliding the new battery in and putting the cover back on. Then we fire up the unit with the new battery in it. It'll go through some diagnostic tests and we're good to go. I hope this video has been helpful. If you like this video, please give us a thumbs up and please subscribe.